The final season of Attack on Titan is less than a month away, and we finally got the official trailer of part two of season four. Needless to say, I'm very excited, as this is literally like my top 10 anime ever. Honestly, let's just go ahead and get straight into the trailer, and then I'll give you guys my predictions and thoughts afterwards. So with that said, let the reaction commence. Okay. Right, he's still alive. Oh shit, captions. Oh my gosh, the fight is around the corner. What are you still fighting for? Right, because Rana just wants to get the hell out of there. Oh my gosh. To come into contact. Oh my gosh. This is a lot. This is a lot. Who? Who is that? Oh my gosh. What is happening? Yes, 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 that is her. That's her, bro. That's Emir, of course. Emir's alive! Okay. Wait, is that a... Yeah, that's a young Mikasa. But right, Aaron and Zeke have a plan that involves them making contact with each other. I don't know what that plan is, but does it lead them to meeting Emir? And how does that have anything to do with the euthanasia? My thoughts are all over the place. Am I tripping or is this Zeke with longer hair? How much of a time skip is this? But they come in contact with each other and something something happens. I don't know what, but then we get Emir. This is so obviously Emir. Okay, so we obviously know Aaron's plan along with Zeke. And actually, Yelena's also in on it. It's to stop the Eldians from being able to breed anymore because they'll always be treated as monsters and they feel it's best that they don't exist. Aaron can't use his founding titan powers unless he comes in contact with somebody with royal blood, such as Historia or Zeke. The coordinate is also what helps him activate the rumbling. We know that much to be true. With the coordinate, he can control Titans. So maybe that scene of them like touching heads is them starting the rumbling and he's gonna use it on parody? We also saw a shot of Annie who is still crystallized. I feel like it would be a waste not for her to like break out of this before the show is over. So maybe she'll play a big role too as the female Titan. I don't know whose side she would be on ultimately now cause she's missing a lot. Like there's a lot she doesn't know about. But we'll see and also Gabby finally coming to her senses saying that there aren't devils on Paradise Island, they're humans. So she's finally getting the character development she should have had for a long time. Needless to say, I'm excited for this. It feels like it's only gonna get more depressing, but we got to see a lot through just this trailer alone. Basically everything I've been thinking I've voiced out to you guys, so it's probably best to end the video right here. Wait, I just realized I didn't give my predictions for what I think is gonna happen for the final part of the season. So prediction one, Rhino versus Aaron. It's not even gonna be a contest in my eyes. Aaron's gonna kick his ass. Not only does he have three different powers, but it's confirmed that your mental state affects the strength of your titan and we can all agree aaron has a much clearer goal than rhina does now why i think emir is even around maybe she's necessary for aaron to tap into his founding titan powers like we know he needs contact with somebody but she was the original founding titan so i'm sure she knows things zeke and aaron simply just don't i was contemplating whether i wanted to record this part but the show is literally around the corner so i wanted to let you guys know that i'm really excited for it and as many questions as i have we'll just have to wait and see how the story unfolds how is emir alive and why is she a child that's her you can't tell me it's not because then he goes to the coordinate which is that super bright light talking about 2,000 years I've been waiting or something. Okay, so many questions, but look, that's my reaction. I was all over the place, <laughs> but I am excited and I hope to see you guys in January when this comes out. See you in the next One Piece, Demon Slayer, Attack on Titan, and another anime since Tag Top Destiny just ended. With that being said, my name is Christian. I appreciate you guys making it through the whole video and I'm out of here. Later.